Here's a video to show you how to load and operate your Thumbler's UV10 vibratory rock tumbler. First thing you're going to do is you're going to load the barrel up with your rough and media. The barrel needs to be at least halfway full, which is about the center line of this blue ribbon around the barrel. However, to get the best tumbling action in the barrel, you're going to want to be about three quarters of the way full. So go ahead, fill your barrel up with your rough and your media, get it to about three quarters full. Once you have the barrel three quarters full, you're going to add six ounces of 180 range grit. Um, that for us is our medium grit that we sell. If you don't have a scale to weigh out six ounces of grit, don't worry. One tablespoon of grit is about one ounce. So six tablespoons of grit is what you're going to need to use to run your Thumbler's UV10 step one. So go ahead and dump that in your barrel. Now that we've got the grid in there, it's time to start adding the water. I'm going to explain to you what we're looking for as we add this water prior to actually doing it because this is going to be pretty loud since the lid's not on it and you won't be able to hear me talking while I'm doing it. So I'm going to explain it and then you can watch me do it. What we're looking for is a nice coat of grit on everything. Too much water and the grit's going to sit at the bottom of the barrel. Not enough water and you're not going to get the tumbling action that you want. So you got to keep an eye on it as you're adding the water one tablespoon at a time looking for that perfect coating of grit on your material. Well let's turn it on and start adding some water. Now that the tumbler is running, you're going to want to check it two to three times a day to make sure the tumbling action is the way it's supposed to be. If needed, you can add a tablespoon of water at a time to get the tumbling action back up to par.